Hello, and we're back with Beholder. Uh, we're currently streaming on Twitch, so Twitch is saying hi. Hi, hi, hi. That's that's my impression of Twitch. Uh, Beholder, we're playing as like Stasi people, so it's lovely. We need to investigate this person called Shrimmer as well. So let's ask Shrimmer's uh, wife. Hello. My name is Carl, new building manager. It's nice to meet you. I'm Mary Shrimmer. Did you bring a family here? We moved in. It'd be nice to meet you. Have you got a saucepan? I have a suitable saucepan. Here it is. She just happened to have it on her. That works for me. Ah, oh, thank you very much. It's very kind of you. Now, about your husband. Uh, does he have any interesting hobbies or anything that the stars might be interested in? He looked upset. He doesn't feel well. He received a parcel containing a reef of film. Klaus likes taking photos. This will cheer him up. He likes taking photos. Hmm. Must... Must be evil. Uh, let's check quickly. Apartment 1 is Schwimmer. New jump directive. Singing in front of the mystery order. Okay. Well, we could... Ah, Shrimmer's in there. I was going to say we could bug his apartment. Now, right, let's have a quick look. See if we can find the doll while we wait for other people to appear. Could I have clicked on the red text? Probably. I oh, did, did it get added to my... Let me see. Let's see. Did it get added to my portfolio? No, I, it automatically gets added to my portfolio. So we, we know he takes photos. I was worried there for a Welcome moment. to the Empire. Stay shiny. That's the dragon. Thank you very much. That's very loud. Doll. Found the doll. That was easy. Where are you, dear? You asleep? That's a little bit creepy, and that's that's my wife. So, where's my daughter? It's 5 a.m. Is it 5 a.m.? Oh, is it 5 p.m.? I have no idea. Oh, we need to go ask you about, about Shrimmer. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Uh, I'd like to introduce myself. I'm a man of wealth and taste. Some people call me Lucifer. Uh, anyways, ask about the son. Ask about the husband. Uh, ask about Klaus. He is a person of worth. He helped me to acquire a nice bottle of Zerus. He's an expert in wine. Okay, he's an expert in wine. Oh, oh, hello, another one. Uh, quickly, need to talk to the wife. Uh, about the doll, about the saucepan. There we go. Here we go. Spare no sugar for the compot. Looks like water. It looked like water last time. It looked like water because we have neither sugar nor apples. It's not my fault that you couldn't get a provision card for sugar. Sure, up, sweetheart. Now we have enough sugar. Right. Oh, hello. Yeah, I need to talk to you. Come here. Come here. What do you want from the archivist? Get acquainted. Uh... Do you have any books? You're an archivist, right? You just gave me a son of a list of books to study. The library's an option, but there's always a line. What's wrong with the library? It's quiet in there. It's a nice place for young men to spend time. Can't you spend your money on something more useful than books? Uh, what do you know about Klaus? What do you want to know? I don't know anything you don't know. More of a curiosity than a terrible saying. I had a co-worker who was poking his nose and opening his business and documents. What happened to him? He was in jail. You've learned more than you have to. Goodbye, young man. Okay, cool. Whatever. Um, is there anything? Martha lost her doll. Fine books and economics. Okay, that's just the only thing I've got left. Right. Where is my daughter? Do you know anything about books? Oh, that's about your your son. No, end of conversation. Okay, Shrimmer, maybe you know.
Oh, the issue with the library is well known to me. Not only the line, the library workers also have to like you, otherwise they'll send you away without an explanation. But I can help you. I have books from when I worked in the counting bureau. I'd be happy if they help your son study. Everyone should pursue a higher education. Too bad, few people agree. Thank you, Klaus. That is really kind of you. I am sorry that I will probably end up turning you into the regime. Dad's gotta do what dad's gotta do, right? Uh, here you go. I never dreamed of such wealth. I might not go to the rest nest after all. To library, I mean. Good for you. Right, let's go talk to, uh, Alonius Spack. <laughs> this is the most culturally diverse block in the country, probably. An American, a Russian, and a Brit. This is very true. Uh, meat. I'm here to introduce myself. I'm Carl, the landlord. I'm honored. I'm Dr. Lo Spack, a physician. I must have heard about me the entire city did. Of course I heard. I mean, please don't praise me. I was just doing my duty. Just doing my duty. Uh, that's great. Uh, let me know if you need anything. No, oh, what possibly could I have? Nothing. You're very busy. How's it going? Oh, busy, busy, busy. Patients fight on me. Are you a doctor? That's the real one, don't you doubt it. You can cure even a healthy man. I'd say especially healthy. Any education? Are you kidding me? I've dedicated my life to treating people. Your doubts hurt me. Sorry, this is a manning job. How can you, dear? Here's a good way for you to relax. Just be reasonable. Oh! Oh! I got a bottle of whiskey! Sweet. Okay. Is my daughter on this bus? No. Where is my daughter? Is my daughter missing? Why is my daughter missing? I thought it was the doll that was missing, not my daughter. Has my daughter been kidnapped? Maybe I talked to you about the doll. What, Carl? I found the doll. Okay. Oh, oh there she is! <gasps> Hello! I don't know how I didn't see you. I'm a terrible dad. Here you go. I thought it's a great game. Want me to tell you about it? Now you'll be a minor baby than a rebel, and I'll be the rescuer. What a game. Maybe you'd better play with your letter blocks. I'll build a coal mine out of letter blocks. That is really creepy. Uh, that which is hidden will be revealed. I must profile Klaus. Okay, I guess I've got enough to start profiling him. Uh, profile tenant. Klaus, living in apartment number one, male, lives with Maria, occupation. Literature teacher? There we go. Now, let's go check if there's anyone in the apartment, because I kind of want to put uh, some cameras in it. Nope. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Okay, open the door. Open the door. Quick, 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 quick. Right. Welcome to the Empire. Stay shiny. Beldurnik! Thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the uh, welcome to the Empire. He's a back salesman. Damn it, he used to be a literature professor. Now he's a tobacco salesman. That's the one. Thank you very much, chat. Welcome to the Empire. Thank you for subscribing and soaring the channel. Uh, I want to quickly buy some cameras of wealth and taste. Some people call me Lucifer. Quick, 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 quick. Oh good, right, there's no one on that.
Nothing here. Nothing here. Don't worry. Nothing here. Okay, let's go profile him again. Haven't managed to search his room yet. Right, let's profile tenant. Klaus. Apartment number one. Male. Lives with Maria. He's a tobacco salesman. There we go. I got fined 100 for getting it wrong last time. Call the ministry and report the completion of the task. You'd assume they'd have got the profile and they would know that being completed, but whatever. You must evict him. Ask about the wife. What will happen to his wife? We don't care about her. Do what you think is best. How can I evict him? Talk with Schumer. We'll be fine with, any with him moving out. It'd be better if you put him when he violates our directives. This is your duty, comrade. Okay. Um, okay, right. So we either get to evict him by asking him, or we could just find an excuse to get rid of him. Uh, like, you know, planting something and firing him. I don't know. What does chat think? Do we, do we try and convince him? I mean, he did give us the books. But that might be awkward. We'll be like, hi, so we need to leave. Why? Uh, because otherwise we, um, we, we will frame you. Or do we just frame him? And I get more dollars for reporting, apparently. Pants something. Jesse Linek. Oh, Bad, bad, uh, bad influence. Planting something. Frame, friend, frame, 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 frame. Be evil, frame, be nice, poll. I don't think we need a poll. The chat, all but like two people have said frame him. Be nice, talk to him. Okay, okay. Uh, Pav, do you know how to do a poll? We could do a poll. We could have, um, nice evil. <laughs> Evil's basically frame him or find an excuse to get rid of him. Uh, he probably has those literature books that we were told about, like, not being allowed uh, recently. Um, philosophy books, but... Yeah, Pav's gonna do it in a sec. Right, so yeah, we're gonna do a, we're gonna do a little bit of a... Uh, poll and see what happens. In the meantime, while we set the poll up, I'm gonna talk to um, Spack. Spack... Uh, has um, something going on. Hello. You want to talk? I have a request, a very private one. Due to the demands of my profession, I have no time for personal matters. Saving people 24-7 is my civic duty. Why are you here then? This is not 24-7. Uh, I know it's hard to believe, better looking at me, but I'm very shy around women. I'm confused and blushing in every inch of my extremely gifted self is sweating profusely. That is lovely to know. I cannot get that image out of my head. What can I do for you? Get you some deodorant? <laughs> Your wife is amazing, Carl. She's taken. You clearly know a lot about dealing with women. Yeah, you put cameras in there, smoke detectors. I'm alone. Find me a woman, Carl. She'd be a good woman to have in the bedroom in the kitchen. Okay, that is not creepy whatsoever. Um... Uh, yes, so the philosophy books. Yeah, still not doing anything legal yet. I'm gonna keep an eye out. We can always plant something illegal. Oh, our wife wants to uh, chat. Let's chat with our wife. What, Carl? Chocolates! I was telling a man in the top hat likes walking in the house occasionally. You can buy some things from him. You're the master of bringing people down. Sometimes I think I live with... He's selling new household appliances. The old woman on the second floor showed me the perfume soap she bought from him last month. I don't have anything like that now, but you can take a look at our other useful items. Uh, do you need the soap? We have an entire box of coal tar soap I bought from our ration cards. You're unbearable, Carl. The rope around your neck would serve you well. Buy some sweets from Martha. The poor thing hasn't had a treat for months. Okay, so we want to buy some, like, chocolates for Martha. Sure, we can do that. In the meantime, I might need to plant something. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to search their room when I get a chance. Evil, 58%, nice, 38%. Yep, uh, Evil wins over 20, with 20 point lead. Evil it is. Oh, a new government directive. It's legal to use foreign currency. Use or own. There's a difference there. They're sleeping. I don't think I'm sneaking while they're sleeping. I think that that wakes them up. So I guess for now, we'll just fast forward to time. Actually, no. We can ask people about... If, uh, like, someone knows someone Aloysius could date. Do you have a dignified lady for the Doctrine? Uh, no. Welcome to the Empire. Stay okay. shiny. Uh, Nashk, seven months. Thank you very much. Right, let's see if your wife knows anyone. We're looking for chocolate. A way to frame you down in the, uh... Part one. Or the ability to talk to someone else about Spack's loneliness. Or the opportunity to get into their apartment. Uh, oh, he's coming up here. Doing nothing. Hi. Oh, that was close. Oopsie. Okay, I need you to leave. Go sell some tobacco. Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Need to talk to you. Good afternoon. Uh, do you have a dignified lady? I have a niece who's excellent marriage material. She's smart and beautiful as I was in my youth. And as she doesn't live in the city, I can send a telegram and invite her to my place. Let him come and introduce her to him. End the conversation. Done! Thank you. Uh, when Shpak is back, you're on. It takes a long time to lock on a door. Hi. I found a girlfriend for you. Who is she? Rosa Rannick's niece. Can't wait to meet her. You should visit her out soon. What a release. That's excellent. Sweet. Pimp my bride achievement unlocked. Oh, and top hat and you're leaving. Excellent. Let's go to the top hat first. Grab that chocolate. Delicious, delicious chocolate. Uh, we're going to buy chocolate. Do you have anything illegal? No. Hmm. Oh, wait. Aren't apples illegal? All apples, yes. So we can use an apple. I'm gonna grab an apple. It's expensive, but I think it's worthwhile. Unfortunately, you are now in the house. So I need to get rid of you. Okay, let's give you the candy. Yeah, chats on it too. Chats are like apples, 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 of apples. Or Carl. But I did buy some sweets. Wait, what? What, Carl? I not want to get satisfied with anything. I asked you to buy some chocolate for a little one. The kid shouldn't eat crunches. Buy it and then bring it to me. Don't give it to Martha. But I, I bought chocolate. I'm imagining that I bought chocolate. 
I've got chocolate right here. I don't know what I'm going to do now. Oh, do you want chocolate candy? I'll buy that as well. Can't make anyone happy, can you? Right, where's my wife? Hello. They didn't the soap you wanted. You bought sweets, Carl. Thank you. I'm full of worry these days. When I close my eyes, I can see those bulls leading the previous mail manager out the nose. It breaks my heart to think that you're being in his place. And it purge these thoughts from your mind. You'll be fine. You're not being silly, right? I'll do a good job. What's the previous manager thought like this too? Mm. Alright, well that is sorted. Sarah Wattersmack. Okay, hello. Hello, dear. What are you doing? Ranek's niece. Which apartment does Alolius live? I can't live with Alolius yet. I need to talk first day. Uh oh. Tell the doctor about Rannick's niece, who wants to live with him immediately. That's a little bit forward, I gotta say. A little bit forwards. Why are you cleaning the ground. Why won't you talk to me? There we go. There's a woman on your doorstep. She said she came to see you. Really? That's strange, but let's see. What happened? Martha's sick, Carla. We no medication at home. Can you find some aspirin for our girl? Just a fever. Okay, so we know we can buy aspirin when that guy comes along over here. So we should be fine. I don't see this. I don't want a camera here. New government directive. Imported soda is prohibited. As well it should be. Okay. Maybe we should open up some of these extra apartments. We've got the money. Move in. Yeah, I'll move you in. And no one wants to move into my building. Ah, great. Hello. What do you want? I'm Carl, I'm the new manager. Jones Pompadino, Bozen on call badge. Two, three, four, dash, eight, seven. I'm prepared for a long trip. We're sailing abroad. While we're training for the outside affairs committee, I'll live in your cell. This training is obligatory for everyone who travels abroad on business. We're talking anti-propaganda training. Yes, I live alone. Uh, okay. Leaving house soon. You uh, right? Yeah, we're leaving. It out, uh, we're going to leave. The barge is ready. We're waiting for the outside affairs committee to instruct the crew. Where are you heading? Through the bay to the south, then towards the Knoll Sea. Have you been to Sheer? This is the largest trade port city. It's the three government for the last decade. We'll stay on the port for a week to unload coal and take works. Let's see then. Okay, um... I can see why you're having anti-propaganda training. Going to a free city. Yeah, basically like I'm the landlord who also spies on people. I can't see what he's doing in there. That maybe he did something illegal. Is 
Is that illegal? They're touching each other. While fully clothed and standing up on the chest. And now she's mopping his feet. They have a weird relationship. They have a very weird relationship. I'm just saying. Okay, why am I watching this? I'm gonna... No! Take me away! Why are you angry? Oh, the aspirin. Whoops, I forgot that our daughter was dying because of aspirin. Well, because of lack of aspirin. We need aspirin. Maybe... Maybe Sp Spack knows. Spack. Spack. Do you know about aspirin? Hello! Why does everyone like these pills? Can you obtain these medications? It breaks my heart to say this, but no. I have no right to prescribe or receive medication. You have to go to the hospital or trade with those who don't need it. <gasps> Damn it! Alright, please go away. I need to enter this room. Please, please go away. Okay, do either of you have aspirin? I was given this in the hospital. Do you have aspirin? Can you give me the pills? What do you want? The weather is nasty. Bring me a cardigan then. Find the cardigan. Okay, so I need a cardigan to trade for pills. Have you got aspirin? Okay, your wife deals with that. Okay, what about you? Do you have aspirin? No, you don't have aspirin. Okay. Broken TV. Oh, I've got the ability. I'll fix it as soon as I can. I've got the ability to repair that. I've got stuff. Hello. Nope. Um, you don't have any aspirin that I can talk about. That's fine. Let's fix the TV. We still need a way to get aspirin or a cardigan. You! Come here! Trade. Cardigan is 255. Aspirin is more expensive. But aspirin is a certainty. Aspirin is done. Let's sprint. Take this. Right, and then... Apartment's clear. Go! No! There we go. Unlock. Go, 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 go. We've got limited time. Find something incriminating. It's illegal to own these books! Quick! Get out of there! That is enough. That is enough. We're good. Which directive is it? Uh, 4 1. Is it dangerous to carry apples around? No one really checks me. Write a report on Mr. Carl Schwimmer. Apartment number one. Violated directive number 41. And then... Send. Oh, directive... Oh, it was a directive date. Okay, let's do that again. Klaus Schwimmer, apartment number one. Violated directive number 41. From... I will double check this, but I'm putting it down as a second for the moment. Whoa! I lost the evidence? Surely the evidence still exists. It's not even the evidence, it's just I know it. I've 
got to go back and find it? It's annoying. Right, what do you what do you got to talk about? What happened? My feels worse. The aspirin didn't help. She needs a doctor. Find a doctor. Oh god, quick! We know where to find a doctor. My daughter is sick. Can you examine her? Of course, examine her. It's my duty. I'm a doctor. What do you want? You're getting married. I bought a cruise ticket to the southern shore of our honeymoon. Uh, sorry, you're not meant to be- wait. Oh, thanks to you. But I have a request. I want to make Sarah a gift. I don't know her very well. I don't even know what she likes. Can you ask around about her? Okay. I would definitely treat you to a slice of chicken innards pie. It's delicious. Okay, uh, and then many people have many jobs going on, and there are all the things. Did they love saying Aspirin or was it cyanide? I mean, to be fair, Aspirin, all it does is like, you know, thin the blood, maybe get the temperature down a bit. Doesn't really massively solve much. But, uh, yeah, what we're gonna do is gonna end it here for YouTube again. Um, Twitch will be carrying on a little bit longer. So, YouTube, it's been grand having you. Uh, we will, of course, continue this tomorrow, unless you happen to catch the stream, in which case, you know, you've seen it already. Um, like, subscribe, comments, etc. That'd be grand. And, uh, yeah, we'll catch you again another day. Stay shiny.